Good morning, students. Today, I wanted to clarify certain doubts with regard to the abrupt postponement of the KCLU exams, which is scheduled to be held from 21st of this month. And here, KCLU has notified in its notification in number 730 of 2021 bar 22 citing that the as per the orders of the vice chancellor till the completion of the challenge valuation revaluation the proposed examination can be postponed and it has further clarified that the examination may be held in the second week of the November and further it has been clarified that those who get completed or passed in the, the challenge evaluation and the revaluation their fees can be refunded. So this is the, the notification yesterday we got simultaneously one more notification has also been released. So, here the notification concerning to the, the honor students, that is uh, the law honor students. Here, this is uh, given with regard to the certain confusion among students. Here, the, this notification in its number 732 bar 2122. It has stated that the postponement of the exams will not be applicable to the honors courses. So here these two notification in a single day has made a lot of confusion among the student community, especially the students who went to their the concerned state, for example, certain students they are studying in KCLU, they may be from Tamil Nadu, from Kerala, and so many states. So, they have made sufficient preparations by booking the, the traveling tickets and all the preparations they have made to come and attend the examination. Here, who are all the honor students? Why this uh, a sudden uh, postponement of the exams? So, first I will clarify that honor students, uh, there are only limited colleges are there. Here, uh, majority of the colleges, uh, they, they, they will not come under this honors course. Only three or four colleges are there. And uh, uh, the, um, uh, here, majority of the colleges, uh, they will not uh, under this honors course. So, I think uh, majority of the students, uh, they are not concerned with regard to the, the honors course. For them, the examination will be held as per the schedule. So that is one thing. And uh, second thing, with regard to the postponement of the exams, why this uh, postponement of the exams? So what is the matter? What is uh, happening with regard to the, the exams and the, uh, the uh, exams and when will be the classes will be held? When will be the normalcy? The student community the, uh, which expects the normalcy. So they want to uh, have the, the offline classes. They want to get the, uh, the uh, what you call sufficient time to get prepared for the exams. So that is the problem of the student community. And here they have been hampered by getting the, the online classes. Because online classes, uh, it is proved that it is not so much effective like uh, offline classes. So that is uh, one thing. And further, the student community is also worried about the uh, what is happening with regard to the 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 so many the UGC orders. That is the uh, UGC orders with regard to the promotion. And uh, they are worried, uh, they, they are thinking with regard to the new education policy. 
so according to new education policy the normalcy has been set and uh, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the 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 normal academic year it has to be commenced from the october itself and uh, the case uh, the karnataka state law university also announced that uh, from november 15th uh, the classes uh, regular classes will be held so this is a uh, one point and here according to the new education policy so there are a lot of uh, tremendous uh, changes uh, has to be done with regard to the education curriculum so here in fact uh, kslu itself is the champion of uh, this uh, new education policy here in spite of all these things uh, why we have not been promoted why uh, we should not get promotion that is the the question the student community is facing here what i want to say that here uh, there are uh, two repetitions uh, i can come across with regard to the one is filed in the dara before the honorable uh, darwad bench it has been filed by the mahantesh in its uh, wp number 104008 bar uh, 2021 and another uh, before the our honorable uh, high court of karnataka uh, that is filed by navin kumar so that is the wp 18172 bar 2021 here these uh, two read petitions uh, they are uh, playing a pivotal role with regard to this uh, even it with regard to this uh, postponement of the exams also it has played certain role it is my opinion so here what is the grievance of the students here the grievance of the students is not uh, a special one here what the other students uh, they are facing the the problems these students also they are facing the same thing and uh, these uh, students they dared enough to go to the the honorable uh, high court of karnataka here it's not the cause of the the mahantesh or uh, navin kumar here i feel that uh, majority of the student community they have prepared and they wanted to write the examination and they are uh, certain the uh, section of the student community they are cursing our uh, yeah, academic year uh, it is uh, it is going to be postponed so when this the so the entire student community they are uh, reeling under the uh, the uncertainty when this uncertainty should be complete off so here as you know that according to the ugc guidelines uh, the which are which are the exams uh, which has to be due uh, which has to be the students has to be promoted uh, after uh, july 2021 so that is the ugc guidelines and one other is uh, with regard new education policy so these uh, two points uh, has to be considered by the karnataka state law university and uh, here with regard to the all these things uh, with regard to the uh, the uh, with regard to the uh, other aspects that is a timely uh, timely publication of the results and uh, uh, what to call student friendly what to call uh, examinations here student friendly examination means it doesn't mean that uh, uh, any other thing here means certain uh, the, 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 there should be uh, certain units in the subjects may be reduced some liberation of the question pattern may be done i appreciate the karnataka state law university it has uh, uh, what you call uh, uh, recently it has uh, liberalized the the question paper, paper pattern that means uh, the students uh, uh, can write any uh, any questions out of the given questions so certain questions will be given and they can be they can have got the liberty to write the the prescribed questions among the given questions so like this some units can also be the reduced so here why this chaos why this problem with regard to the the student community could not able to get the results in, in proper time why uh, why what is happening why uh, the uh, why the certain student communities uh, uh, results has come to be announced late and certain students uh, community they have to apply for revaluation but uh, they were supposed to take the examination immediately even before getting the uh, article results 
they have to appear before the the uh, even uh, for the exams so likewise there are certain uh, chairs are there here i feel that probably you may see that the student uh, poll has been taken student uh, uh, the opinion has been taken with regard to the online examination student voting poll has been taken for online examination not for online valuation so this i specifically say now majority of this uh, problem with regard to results uh, which has to be announced later and uh, certain students they even they get passed in uh, subjects but uh, their uh, mask shows the, they have failed in the subject and certain subjects uh, certain students uh, the internal marks has been given has not been given even though they are present to the examination like this so many problems are there because of this online valuation or uh, digital valuation i can say here student opinion student consent has been taken with regard to the online examination but there is no online examination offline examination is going on i am not uh, talking with regard to the whether it can be held it should not be held so that uh, student community it will decide and the karnataka state law university it will decide but how far this online exam uh, online valuation sorry online valuation it uh, it uh, helps the what you call students here for conducting the online valuation or digital valuation the university has to pay extra money for the the scanning of the scripts and they have to pay the money to the valuators also and uh, the the the, uh, the valuation will not be it, it is uh, it is delayed more than the the earlier pattern of the the centralized valuation or uh, offline valuation that is when the valuator he sees the scripts physically he can feel the the pulse of the student but uh, the scripts may be somewhere and uh, they have to value that is the online valuation and because of the the problems in the the uh, that uh, digital valuation the problems may be it may be anything probably you may see network problem all those problem and uh, scripts uh, which has been uh, uh, kept uh, that is uh, uh, the the valuator could not able to value like that so here so many problems will be there here the student community what it, what uh, the it it express timely results and uh, uh, normalcy so here when normalcy is not there timely results are there they get fed up with regard to the the system and uh, with regard to the the, the with regard to the offline classes uh, uh, they are uh, they uh, we cannot expect that uh, in this situation the offline classes can be held but now the with regard to the covid uh, all these things it is over it is not uh, it is uh, uh, it is a uh, uh, it is not uh, of a such a alarming stage, stage that uh, lockdown and all those things uh, which is going to be taken place so this is the thing what we can see here next uh, important thing is that uh, again on these uh, on uh, uh, 18 10 2021 the ball is in the our uh, honorable high court of karnataka with regard to taking the decision with regard to the these uh, two writ petitions uh, that is uh, 104008 and uh, 18172 so here what should be done so what is the uh, uh, what the what should be uh, what, what will be the judgment so here Oh, what will what sort of the judgment will come so the student community the it is a uh, uh, the anxious with regard to the the judgments here uh, they can be promoted uh, or they have to take the exams so this sort of the the uh, the clarifications uh, the student community is expecting so here whatever it may be students please make your preparations uh, don't uh, waste your time anyhow you have got the sufficient time one month the time is there one month time is there you can uh, make sufficient preparations and if the god's grace is there uh, you may be promoted uh, as you were uh, uh, what you call wish that uh, the engineering students has been promoted twice uh, diploma students promoted twice and uh, the other degree students are promoted twice it may be uh, there uh, 
uh, the article uh, luck i can say but this is the professional uh, uh, course and bca according to bca guidelines uh, the the the, uh, the the university has to work and uh, our honorable high court of karnataka it will take uh, the good decision so make your preparations in spite of all this chaos and normal unnormalcy uncertainty you you should be very much confident enough anyhow the university has given sufficient time for you and from november second we converts you are going to have the examination sufficient time is there and you can make sufficient preparations so this is the word i want to put you from our channel